Yo, what's up everybody? Tweets here and in this video I am going to show you how to override the vanilla optics like uh, 100 scope and the ACOD to make it universal in night vision mode. So pretty much you just make a folder in your P drive and then you're going to drop a config in here. Um, in that config you're going to pretty much if you go to your P Z weapons go to uh, attachments and then optics grab that config in there and in here you'll find all the configs for all the vanilla optics you're gonna search and get the hunting or a card now the only thing that I did so let me just go here hunting. instead of it be an item optics base. I changed the base class to the Kazuer optic. Gave it my class name, but I kept it with the I kept the main path to their hunting optic. Everything else I kept the same. The only thing also you're gonna change is you're gonna add this attachments to it for the battery, and you are gonna change your inventory slots to these inventory slots so that way it'll attach to pretty much anything that'll make it universal and then you're also going to change and add NV optic equals one to make it night vision you're not going to worry about the damage system I mean you can up it a little bit make it more durable I think by generic it was 50 yeah it's 50 I made it 100 on mine down here under optic info, you're not going to need to change anything. Um, I upped the night vision, I think by generic it was 800. Let me just double check. Yeah, and I made, I just added 900 and then 1,000. And that way it can uh, range out to 1,000 meters. Um, and then I just kept everything else at the hide sources, everything else the same. And then the last thing you're going to need to add to that config is this part here, Energy Manager. To this controls the energy with the battery usage and stuff. So you definitely you need that. So it's pretty much the vanilla hunting scope config. And I just changed the class name to make it my own class name. I changed the base class to the Kazuer Optic, so there's no scripting needed. I added attachments, battery D. I changed the inventory slots to everything, all these here. I added night vision equals one. And then I changed the distance to go up to a thousand. And then I added energy manager. And that's it. And it's the same thing if you take use the vanilla ACOD optic. It's the same thing. Kazuer optic base class. Battery attachments. Inventory slots. NV optic equals one. You can mess with the durability if you want. And I didn't really change any of this here so this is a card so i didn't mess with the the distance um and then energy manager and that is that's it that is all i changed and then when you're done that all you gotta do is just pack it up and test it it's just one config and then you'll get in the game You'll spawn your items in. Make sure you turn it nighttime. I already spawned them in, but you'll just spawn in your, your items. Make sure you get a uh, couple batteries to test and a gun to test them on. Now, I'm using the M4, which originally the hunting wouldn't go on. But then you just, you just test it, and then you put your uh, scope on. Put your battery in, and then boom. 
and then each test to zoom. Now you have night vision. And then same with the A-Drod. So you pull that one off, put the A-Drod on, and then boom. And now you have an A-Drod that does night vision, and you just still scroll up and get the regular with the iron sight. And then night vision A-Drod. And that's it. And then now you can have universal hunted stopes with night vision and same with ADROD. And they'll go on anything that has a scope or optic attachment. And yeah, that's it. So uh, yeah, if you have any questions, join my Discord below. Make sure to subscribe, like, and comment for more. And I will catch you in the next one. Peace out.